Have you ever noticed the sky above moon is always black, even though when it is facing towards the sun? Well, space is whole lot of nothing, and nothing is of course black. This is one way to explain, but it's not completely true. So why do you think space is black, even though it is full of big bright stars? Welcome to Astrophy's Answers, where we answer your space question. If you have any question for us, then let us know in the comments below. We will try to answer your questions in our next video. Today, we will find out why is space black. There are several reasons behind space being black. Some of them are Albers paradox, atmospheric effects, and dark matter. Let's explore each of them and find out why space is black. Part of the reason to explain why Moon's sky is always black is due to its atmosphere. Unlike Earth, Moon has very thin atmosphere and nothing to reflect back light, which makes its sky always black. But there is more reason for space being black than this. Space being black has nothing to do with light. We know there are billions of stars in our universe and other objects, such as planets, that reflect light, so when you look up at the sky at night, it should be extremely bright. But instead, it's dark. This is where Olber's paradox comes into effect. Before explaining about Olber's paradox, we must explain about the expansion of the universe. We all know the fact that universe is expanding, and it's expanding faster than the speed of light. According to Olber's paradox, the light emitted by distant galaxies might be stretched and turned into infrared waves, which are not detectable by our human eyes. And because they are undetectable, they appear black to the naked eye. However, the more accepted science is the effect of atmosphere. Like we see blue sky on Earth as the molecules of Earth's atmosphere reflect sunlight, which is visible on Earth. But the space is vacuum and filled with nothing. There are no molecules to reflect the sunlight. There are billions of stars in our universe, and you might think at least one of the stars should be giving brightness to space. Or at least one of the planets, dust storms should be reflecting the light. Yes, it is true that there are billions of stars in our universe, however our universe is much bigger than this. This can be easily explained within our solar system. The closest star to our solar system is Proxima Centauri, about 4.2 light years away. And yet, it is nowhere near to lighten up our solar system. Even our very own sun cannot far away in Pluto. It receives 1600 times less sunlight than Earth does. So, the number of stars is clearly not enough to light up our space. Even if there were enough stars, there is nothing to reflect the light, thus making space dark. And lastly, comes the dark matter. Scientists believe space of full of dark matter and energy which does not react with normal matter or light. However, this is complete hypothesis. There are several theories to prove dark matter and energy, but none of them are verified yet. As dark matter does not interact with light, space will still be dark. If you are curious about dark matter, then we have another video explaining about dark matter. Find the link in description. Lastly, if you found any value on this video, consider subscribing. This helps us to make more exciting content in future.